Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is uh, April 20th of 2018. It's uh, Friday about almost 7 a.m. in the morning. And this is, let's see if this is Friday. This is Friday, isn't it? Yes. So this is, thank God, it's Friday. You can see I put a little timer up there on the screen. I'm going to try to hold this to no more than 30 minutes. Uh, you know, it's difficult for me. I start rambling on about stuff like I am now. Uh, as maybe you can tell, I only have one monitor on my desktop. And that's the 27 inch. I have two of these Asus. And I did have them side by side. I did have one. It seemed like my computer was a little bit slow. So I disconnected the other monitor and moved it. I also uh, am getting ready to, I think, order a 4K 27 inch monitor. And I have a feeling that I'm not going to want to have, you know, 4K screen here and then have a 1080p screen next to it. Um, but I don't know. You know, I've changed things all the time. The um, monitor, and I talked about it, I think, in a couple other videos, uh, is an LG. And it's been $300 for a long time and I talked about buying it and uh, now it's gone up to 365 but I'm sure it's going to come back down to three I'm not going to get it at 365 because it seems like it's almost always $300 which is a really good price for a 4k monitor I don't have any 4k don't have a 4k TV or a 4k monitor and I'm not sure that I've actually seen 4K. I have a camera that does 4K. And I can tell by how. I have a Canada. A Canada. Canada. Yeah. Uh, this is a Panasonic G7. It shoots 4K video. And then the USB Logitech camera there. Uh, that I'm using that also does 4k you know 4k video um, but I don't have anything to see it with so I'm uh, thinking about uh, getting that 4k monitor when it comes back down to 300 this is my blog which I have been working a little bit on which nobody goes to anymore that used to be my before uh, I started doing YouTube and before, well, even when I was doing uh, YouTube, uh, back in the old days, I had a lot of traffic. Before the World Wide Web was invented, I had a computer bulletin board system. Had a lot of people going to my uh, bulletin board system. Now that Facebook and all that's around, nobody goes to the, it's really hard, I think, if you're thinking of starting a, well, there's all kinds of stuff you can do. You can be, do, you know, YouTube videos. You can do podcasts. I think podcasts are actually uh, pretty popular because I think a lot of people, you know, you can listen to a podcast while you're going to work every day and then of course there's there's blogs now if you have some talent some skills some knowledge of something you can have a, a popular blog uh, but the subjects that I'm interested in now uh, people don't want to come to the blog they go to Go to Facebook and Twitter and places like that. So 
Uh, but I knew a I knew a guy. We used to get together occasionally and talk about computers and politics. We finally, uh, he was uh, not a liberal like I am, and it actually I thought he was a really smart guy and a really nice guy, and we had this mutual interest, big time computers. We were really interested in computers. Uh, he came over with the first digital camera that I, I had ever seen. And I forget what he paid, thousands of dollars for it. It just, you know, blew my mind away. And I can remember showing him uh, Google Maps when that started. He came over and we ordered pizza and whatever. We're ta- sitting there talking computers and pulling stuff on. I said, you've got to see this. This is amazing. And I put in my address, you know, and map pops up and I zoomed in and pulled out and everything. And and uh, I said, okay, give me your address and I'll, you know, we worked together for years. But anyway, give me your address and I'll put it in here. Uh, no. Uh, I said, no, no, kid, give me your address. I'll put it in. A, no. I, you know, he wouldn't give me his address. A very, I joked that, you know, if I ever went over to his place, which I never did, uh, that it, he'd probably have human heads or something in the uh, refrigerator or freezer or something. But uh, so anyway, oh, he, he was really good with computers. He had several degrees in uh, computers and some gr- degrees in other things. And when he had a problem with his computer or with software or something, he worked on it. And there's things that he's oh he said you know and I got this you know software program and uh, this doesn't work and then maybe if he'd say oh, six months later he solved it the problem and I was telling him do a blog do it you know and you know he wasn't interested because he was one of these people that was a in addition to not being a liberal <laughs> uh, he was one of these people that. Uh, no, no, don't want, you know, don't want to tell anything, anything to anybody, don't want anybody to know about anything, don't want to share anything. And I said, you know, just, you can write up what you did. That, you know, don't have to blog every day, don't have to blog every week. Just put with all that work you did, put, put that down, and somebody else will do, can do a search and save them six months or somebody wouldn't do it. Uh but um, then my grandson is really into, well, everybody is, but really into games. And he knows a tremendous about, you know, things, and he does all kinds of things. And I said, just do a, you know, tell people, hey, a little, you know, there's this new game, and put a little bit, and he won't do that. So I'm surrounded by people who, I'm probably one of the most open, honest people in the world, and uh, I'm surrounded by a bunch of people who you'd think they work for the KGB or something like Trump and his friends do. Uh, By the way, um, I get people occasionally that leave something up comment or go to face you know i i follow my family and some friends on facebook I, I don't go there very often but i do if i get a notice that you know uh twitter i never go to twitter i have a twitter page i never go there now when i do things when i make a video and upload it or live stream or whatever you know, notices go to Facebook or, and go to Twitter, but I don't. I don't go there. I don't. I don't like Twitter, and I don't like Facebook. Facebook, I've got to go to because my family, you know, is there. And uh, but uh, here's, of course, my YouTube page, which. As I've said before, and in fact, I remember I said it the other day, that uh, YouTubers really do not go. I can, 
if you produce, if you do YouTube, you know you have available statistics and all that type of stuff, and you'll see that very few people come to your main channel page. Uh, they get a notice if they've subscribed to you that you posted a video, or uh, but they don't come to your like your main page or whatever it just doesn't so really you're depending on and we have found out recently that uh, YouTube isn't pushing out even if you subscribe and even if you click the bell to be notified of everything YouTube's coding or whatever uh, decides by who knows what black magic I guess or uh, something that uh, what they should uh, you know uh, Bill Smith yes he uh, he goes sometimes and watches one of Jim Howard's videos but he doesn't always and uh, did I say Bill Smith Bill Smith is interested in uh, guns and fishing and hunting and he goes to these so uh, Jim Howard just uploaded a video, but we're not going to notify Bill Smith. And uh, I found out, and a lot of other and other YouTubers, my God, we thought if you subscribe, you know, that you'd be notified immediately of everything. But that is not the case. So, so I don't know. You know, setting up these playlists, I'm not sure how much good that really does I don't know but since you don't come to the main page I've been watching on CBS uh, Young's Sheldon the spinoff from the Big Bang Theory and I just really love it uh, it seems like the characters are just perfect you know whoever Whoever did pick, whoever did the casting, uh, that company or person earned their money. Uh, these two, Sheldon and his uh, twin sister, they look like you know they're twins, and they're really cute. And every and the older brother who's kind of not as smart and uh, you know a tip a, a typical kid. He seems like he's per, you know. Just perfect casting. I like they're all so real. And they have really cute storylines and uh, uh, skits going on. So I recommend it to you. It's on regular CBS. But I'm signed up for the CBS Live or whatever that's called. And forget what I'm paying a month. Not very much. But so I watched all the old shows and now I'm caught up uh, here's a device I'm thinking about getting pretty sure I'll get it so when I get it what I will do is this USB no HDMI I will hopefully it'll work my two cameras here I don't think my third camera does you know they have HDMI output so I can be using one of these cameras and and up in the corner there I will, could will be my from my digital uh, Panasonic camera but what I have to check out I'm gonna go order it anyway but what I have to check out is that uh, make sure that the output uh, doesn't time out after a little bit. I think there'll probably be a setting where I can say don't time out. Also, I have to make sure that uh, it doesn't output everything on the screen. Uh, you know, the settings for the uh, for the camera, whatever. But I have two Panasonics, and I think or I have three, but I think, uh, yeah, I don't think this one has. Yes, it does. So I have three. Here's the output. Where are you? There you are. 
there's the output so surely one of these will be so we'll maybe uh, the next video maybe next Friday uh, I'll, because I can get this today I'll probably go ahead and order it you can get it uh, free same day shipping if I order within four hours I think I'll do it after I finish this uh, and so I'll be able to have this feed up here which but the, the cameras I'm using now are are excellent but it'd just be I wonder how much better I can do with uh, a digital camera and uh, up there so that'll be something I'm working on I'll let you know how it works uh, I'll leave, better leave that, not delete it, because I want to add it to the, well, add it to the cart now. Uh, no thanks. I wish they'd bring the price of that 4K monitor down. Oh, here it is, so. Price is now 347 This monitor here is 27 inches. Looks a lot, you know, I think bigger by in the angle there. And, uh, you know, this is not, I'm going by other review, by people on YouTube. By the way, I'm going to go ahead and pay for the protection plan because look here, two years. But I've, all, I've always, you know, not always, I very rarely pay for a protection plan. And especially usually they're pretty expensive. But, I've never, yeah, I did on a chair. I paid for, I paid for the protection plan, but when I contacted the company because the chair, uh, they told me the chair was still under warranty, manufactured warranty, so that the insurance company, well, I've never had one of these companies pay out. I think they have it set up for you, but anyway, for, I don't know, definitely I'll take the $2.00. I'll probably go with the eight dollar for four years plan. Also, I've been watching uh, Lost in Space, and I was a big fan of the old. You know, here's the wonder thistle there of the old Lost in Space. Oops. Um, so I've been watching it, but God, the, the Dr. Smith, I definitely, I honestly believe that the, <laughs> that the, that the Dr. Smith that they have, who the person playing that Dr. Smith now is scary. And, uh, I honestly think she, she must be, she's an excellent, excellent, uh, I guess, um, actress i don't know or i don't know if i've ever seen her before but she is too good in that part uh and then the other thing and somebody else mentioned this to me they, they put it i i'm watching when i'm watching i think oh my god why are they you know these are supposed to be super intelligent people really in, intelligent people and in every show they go and do things that uh, I know it's not real life, but I'm going like so. And then somebody finally, that's what they put it into uh, uh, words or whatever. Well, yeah, that's, you know, that's it or whatever. So, so that bothers me. And I know it's going to happen during the, I think it's an hour long. During every show, they're going to forget what episode I was watching and uh, the wife goes out on a thing of her own, doesn't tell anybody where she's going, what she's doing, puts herself into danger. Uh, the rest of the people will go someplace and not tell anybody, put themselves in danger. And I'm thinking, you know, these, 
these are supposed to be smart people, you know, but so I think that bothers me and it shouldn't, but I'm still watching it. And I forget what, let's see. Eureka, the town of Eureka. And I, I like this. I really don't have any uh, real complaints, about, you know, real complaints about it. I, I like it. It's, uh, it's good. Uh, U.S. Marshal ends up car breaks down in a, the town of Eureka. And uh, I think as you can see, this is him in the uniform. He ends up being the uh, filling in for the sheriff or whatever. But it's, I recommend that to you. And I forget uh, visit, let's see, wait a minute. I don't know what channel is it on. Maybe that'll pop up if I go. Eureka. Sorry, I don't know that one. Echo. What channel is a Eureka TV show on? I couldn't find any linked video skills that can find that. Okay. I think it's either Netflix or Amazon. I also uh, pay for Hulu, and I don't find very much to watch for some reason. Say I pay for Amazon Prime, Hulu, Netflix. It's not adding up yet. To <laughs> you know, I left cable to uh, save money, and then I keep adding these other little. But recently, when I add something, I try to kill some something else. Not a service like you know Hulu or Netflix, or but I try to cut out something else that I'm uh, that I'm paying. So, I wonder if I can make that timer any smaller. It's, it's probably attracting all your attention. No, I can't. It won't shrink. But I'm glad it's there, and I'm not going to stick around for the next uh, few minutes. I'm going to say uh, thank you very much for, um, for watching, and I will see you next week with another, thank God it's Friday. Hey, I didn't talk any politics. I did throw in a couple, if you, if you were listening, I did throw in a couple little things, didn't I? little jabs. But thank you very much for watching and I'll probably, I'm sure I'll make one or two other videos probably. Well, when I get this device uh, today, I may make a video today with it. Uh, hope it comes with the cable that I need because I've got all kinds of, of H. DMI cables and whatever, but I don't know if I can find the one that fits my camera and goes into, I think it's a regular USB on the device. So anyway, so I'll be ma I may be making a uh, video later today. I'm going to stop here and go and order this uh, device. Thank you very much for watching. And... There we are.